Hey, what's going on, my friends? It's your man, Adam Ace Spencer. And today I'm diving into the question, is TaskRabbit legit? Can you make good money on TaskRabbit? Well, I am letting you know it is legit. I mean, I'm here on their website, so clearly it's legit, it's real. And you can see down here, it's partnered with Ikea, one of the top dogs out there pretty much everywhere. So, you know, TaskRabbit is probably going to be around for a little while. Now, the question is, is how legit is it though? I mean, can you make good money? If you guys come to the website and you're here in Boston in particular, of course, depending on where you are, what state, what city, what country you're in, the hourly rates are going to be different. But you can see some of the most popular projects that people get help with here on TaskRabbit and what the average project rate is listed as and you can see cleaning a bathroom in a kitchen average project is $87 up to $162 or maybe planting flowers is $60 up to 120 mounting a TV or a mirror is $65 up to 120 or maybe assembling a table or desk $59 to 132 so that's kind of giving you a sense of what people are spending when it's time to actually uh, pay for some of the services that they're getting help with and when you look at what some of the featured taskers listed here for their hourly rates well help moving jeffrey has 4117 an hour if we come over to Dimitri, help moving, he has 65.88 an hour. And if we look at Andrew K for help moving, he has 82.35 an hour. Let's see who else we got in the mix. You can see another help moving over here with John K at 71.76 an hour. Other services like pet sitting, 29.41 an hour. Or shopping, 82.35 an hour. Delivery, 70.58 an hour. So these are real people. You can see they have completed multiple tasks, thousand plus tasks completed there, 878 here, 175 there. So people are clearly on the platform in making money. It is absolutely legit and you can absolutely make money as well. I've actually made a number of videos sharing with you guys stories of other taskers who are making money, who tend to make at least, you know, pretty much any of the stories I've shared, they have made a minimum of $70,000, I think, through TaskRabbit for the stories that I've shared. So yes, I would answer anyone out there with uh, to that question, is TaskRabbit legit? Yes, it is absolutely legit. Now, all of that said, I don't want to only show you the roses. I want to keep it real with you guys. Um, you know, most people aren't making 100,000, right? 80,000. Most taskers aren't up there. Um, you know, and, and I do believe a lot of it comes down to one, like what you're willing to do to put yourself in a position so that you can make the big bucks. But then also, you know, is that even like a priority? Is that even really what you want? Because most people I think have jobs or at least are just looking at it as a way to make a few extra dollars. And there's no right or wrong, you know, approach. Everyone's different. Everyone has a different need and a different interest. So that's the beauty, you know, the beauty, the, the beautiful thing with a platform like TaskRabbit, where you ultimately are your own boss and you do control when you work and what you want to do, if you want to take a job, what you'll work for and how far you're willing to travel. You know, I think it's kind of the ultimate platform when it comes to providing kind of physical, you know, where you're physically on site, you know, jobs where, you know, physically demanding, um, in which not all jobs are demanding. They do have a ton of different services that don't force you to, you know, break a sweat and, and work your butt off. Like, uh, like I often do. Um, but you know, task rabbit is, uh, you know, I would say a game changer in the sense that other top popular platforms or gig apps don't let you decide your hourly rate. Now, you know, I, I'll be sure to make other videos diving into some of my personal thoughts a little bit more when it comes to task rabbit and that approach there where they're starting to kind of hinder the same things that are making it so great, you know? They're kind of being their own, you know, setback, their their own uh, challenge of, of uh, obstacles that they need to overcome because it's like, OK, yes, we want to give people the flexibility, be your own boss, this, that and the other. But at the same time, they're a business. They do need to stay afloat. They do need to make sure they're good, that they're making money and everyone's happy. So there is a, a, a balance that they try to juggle. And I think at times it doesn't necessarily work out in the best interest of 
all taskers or most taskers or top taskers maybe. And you know, again, video for another day in which uh, I want this video to stay on a positive note because TaskRabbit is, I believe, one of the, if not the best gig at when it comes to making extra money or making money, you know, at your own kind of schedule and being your own boss in which it's not really at your own schedule. Cause you know, you're just saying when your schedule's open and you're willing to work. So kind of is at your own schedule, but kind of not. Cause if you want to work Friday at two o'clock and no one books you at two o'clock on Friday, well, you're not working. So it's, it's, you know, it's kind of like a little iffy there, but um, as you guys can see here, TaskRabbit is all over the place here in the U S and if you look down in the bottom right, you can see other countries where you can find TaskRabbit in the United Kingdom and Canada and France, Germany, Spain, Portugal, Italy. So if you're in any of these states and uh, these cities, if you're near these cities, you should consider signing up with TaskRabbit. Or if you know anyone who's trying to make a few extra dollars, whether it's just $200 a month more or $500 or even, you know, a thousand or a couple thousand dollars a month. Well, you potentially can do it here on TaskRabbit. Like I said, you can make a lot of money here and I have tons of other videos diving into some of the tips and tricks and strategies that I've used to make pretty good money and also some of the stories that other taskers have uh, experienced in their journey here on TaskRabbit as well. So if you guys want to check out some of those videos as well as some of the downfalls with uh, TaskRabbit, why it might not always stay at the top, consider checking out this video next.